Hello everyone, I uh, hope you're all well, uh, it's Kevin here and welcome to another one of my 50 cent coin hunt videos. So I have my two bags of, uh, well 50 cent coins <laughs> of course, uh, 50 euros worth, so that means 100 coins in total. And I'm just trying to find as many different countries as possible, hopefully a few micro states, you never know, and most importantly, just trying to finish out my date run of Irish coins. Uh, so for 50 cent coins, it's just um, the odd few years that I'm missing, mostly uh, the more recent years. Uh, so hopefully um, we'll get some of them today, fingers crossed. <laughs> anyway, I think it's time to get started and see what we'll find today. So hi everyone, uh, yeah I'm back again with uh, more questions anyway, so um, yeah let's get started, okay. So the first one is, uh, am I single? <laughs> so I think someone wants to know if they can ac have access to my money if they start going out with me. Uh, yeah I am single, uh, there's a reason why I have enough time uh, to go through coins. <laughs> um, although it is funny, I started this YouTube channel after a breakup so I think that is a bit of a sign or something, <laughs> kind of like a some kind of crisis I went through and I started a coin channel. Uh, but yeah, um, not trying to be single anyway, so <laughs> I have plenty of money, so uh, yeah, that might help. Um, what resource do I help to identify coins? Um, so I often use an app called Euric, uh, Euric uh, on Android uh, for Euro coins, and then Umista is a great website to use to identify co coins from all over the world, including uh, Euro coins, and you can get the mintage figure of coins on both of those web both of those resources as well, um, but yeah, they're the ones I, I tend to like to use the most. Um, oh, this is going to be a tough one. Uh, what is my favourite Italian coin? Um, God, there's so many to choose from. Uh, commemorative coins, anyway. Um, my favourite, I guess, of the regular coins, like the, the one cent to the um, two euro, I'd say. I'd like the... The one euro the most maybe <laughs> um commemorative coins um maybe the human rights coin or the world food program um i have to have a relook through of all the italian coins uh, that might change um but yeah i don't know it's a bit of a tough question to answer um do i belong to a local coin uh, club uh, no no i'm not a member of a, a coin club or a numismatic society here in ireland um I guess the closest would be is that I'm a member of the Eurocoins uh, Discord, 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 if I can say it right, Discord server. Um, but yeah, like there's guys from all over Europe on that. It's a, it's a really good uh, online community. Um, okay, next up, do I buy coins from the Central Bank of Ireland? Uh, yeah, I have done that the odd time. Uh, it's mainly just annual sets, baby sets. Uh, silver and gold coins that they have for sale on the website uh, no no two euro coins anyway at the minute and uh, yeah i have one silver coin and one gold coin at the minute and i might buy more in the future uh, they're just a bit more expensive to buy silver and gold coins of course <laughs> uh, <laughs> how many easter risings have i found oh uh, god <laughs> it's got to be in the hundreds hasn't it uh I normally get at least one per video and sometimes even multiple per video. I don't know, it's definitely 500 or something. It's hundreds, it must be hundreds. <laughs> um, do I plan to buy a Grace Kelly coin? Um, God no, at the minute they're 3,000 euro and that would be like a, a pretty decent amount of my savings gone on that one coin. Uh, no, 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 I'm, I don't know about buying commemorative coins from Monaco, uh, they're just very expensive, um, especially the Grace Kelly, so no, not at the minute, if I win the lotto, I might buy a Grace Kelly coin. <laughs> um, which country makes the worst commemorative coins? Um, I think that's an easy answer for me, <laughs> uh, sorry to the people of Luxembourg, but I think the ones from Luxembourg are the wor worst. Um, I will say Malta. Is getting a close second the way to carry on they're doing with very low mintage figures and ridiculously expensive so but no i think i think luxembourg in terms of a design is pretty bad i think <laughs> okay so um 
is Game of Thrones my favourite TV series? Um, I think the person saw all the Game of Thrones books, Game of Thrones books behind me, and uh, yeah, there's Jon Snow. If I can point, he's right behind me, up there, <laughs> Jon Snow. Um, but yeah, yeah, no, it was back in the day. Yeah, definitely one of my favourite uh, TV series. Um, when I first found the TV series, then found the books, read them all, loved them, loved the world of it. Um, and uh, yeah, a bit obsessive. <laughs> now the the last two seasons were a little bit more left to be desired, but um, with House of the Dragon out now, um, it's really helped me fall back in love with the world again. I think I thought House of the Dragon was a brilliant uh, TV series. I really enjoyed it. Uh, all the characters and just yeah, just a very good series. I think. <laughs> um, but yeah, I don't think we have any more time for more questions. Um, but yeah, um, let's get back to the coins. And yeah, anyway, there'll be more questions in the next one of these videos. So yeah, hope you enjoyed. Okay, so that is all 100 of those 50 cent coins gone through. Uh, God, Ed, I think Germany has just about one, with Italy a close second, and then Spain. Uh, but anyway, I have a load of Irish coins here to look through, see if any of them are missing, um, are my missing years. And I also have a check through these to see if we came across any low minted coins from the other countries. So I will be back in a sec. Right, so that is all of those coins uh, sorted through and checked. Uh, we got one new coin for the Irish date run, uh, a 50 cent coin from 2004. So at least <laughs> at least there's one new addition to my collection. Um, anyway, apart from Ireland, we got a nice range of different countries anyway. We have the two types from Belgium, King Albert and uh, King Philip, is it, or Philippe? Uh, I don't see him too often anyway on coins, so it's nice to get that one. Uh, where else do we get? Uh, Spain, of course. Uh, Luxembourg. Uh, Estonia. Pretty cool, that made it here. <laughs> uh, Portugal. Greece. Germany. France, the Netherlands, Italy, uh, Latvia, probably my favourite uh, 50 cent design, I don't know why, I just really like it, <laughs> and then finally Austria. Okay, so that wasn't too bad, um, anyway, keep an eye out for my regular 2 euro coin hunts videos, I'll also have more of these cent coin hunts from... 1 cent coins up until 1 euro coins uh, in some point in the future. And um, yeah, I guess that's it. Uh, thank you for watching.